I'm going to show you how to merge PDF files into one on your mobile device in just a few easy steps. This can be helpful if you have multiple PDF files that you need to combine into a single file, such as for a report, presentation, or other project. There are two main ways to merge PDF files on mobile, using an online tool or using a mobile PDF app. Online tools. There are many free online PDF merger tools available, such as I Love PDF and Small PDF. These tools are typically easy to use and don't require you to download any software. Mobile PDF apps. Many mobile PDF apps allow you to merge PDF files. Some popular options include Adobe Acrobat Reader, PDF Expert, and Foxit PDF Reader. These apps typically offer more features than online tools, but they may require you to pay for a subscription. Once you've chosen a merging method, follow the instructions to merge your PDF files. The specific steps will vary depending on the method you're using, but they're generally straightforward. How to merge PDF files into one on mobile using an online tool. For this video, I am using a Google Pixel 7a with Android 14. This is the stock version of Android, but no matter the phone you have, the steps should be the same. The online tools should work on iPhones as well. Open the browser and write on the address bar, Merge PDF. You should see lots of sponsored results, but one site I recommend is ilovepdf.com. Find this site and tap on the address. On the site, you will be able to select PDF files. So tap on the button Select PDF Files. Select a PDF file. After this, tap again on the plus icon from the right and select Other File. You can select as many as you want. After you select all the PDF files you want, you will have the possibility to drag and drop the pages on that merged PDF. If you have made a mistake, you can just move it on this page. After you are pleased with the results, tap on Merge PDF. To download the file, tap on Download, Merged PDF. This is the merged PDF file. You can usually find this file in the Downloads folder. Of course, you can tap on the three dots menu and send the file or download it on other parts of your phone. This is how you used an online tool to merge PDF files. Of course, you can use other tools, but this is one that I use. How to merge PDF files into one on mobile using an app. To install an app to merge PDF files, you will need to go to install the apps from an app store. For this video, I am using a Google Pixel 7a with Android 14. This is the stock version of Android, but no matter the phone you have, the steps should be the same. If you have a Huawei phone, you know you cannot access the Play Store, so you need to use the Huawei App Store. To download and install an app for merging PDF files on your Android device, follow these steps. Open the Google Play Store. Search for Merge PDF, or you can also search for I Love PDF. Tap on the I Love PDF app editor. Tap the install button. Once the app is installed, tap the Open button. Tap on Allow Access to manage all files. You need to allow the app to access the files. Tap on the back arrow. You do not need to buy the premium version or try the 7 days for free the app. Now tap on Tools. Tap on Merge PDF. Find the PDF you want to merge. I will use the Downloads folder. Select the files you want to add. Tap Next. Now you can drag and drop the position of the files. You can move the files by dragging the icon from the right of the name of the file. Tap Merge PDF. Tap Go to File. This is the file that has been merged with all the files you selected. This is how you merge PDF files into one on mobile using an app. Once you've merged your PDF files, it's a good idea to review the merged PDF file to make sure that it's correct. You can do this by opening the merged PDF file in a PDF reader and scrolling through the pages. That's it.
You've now learned how to merge PDF files into one on your mobile device. Thanks for watching. I hope this tutorial was helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more tech tutorials and tips.